Hello, welcome to episode 8 of Happily Untangled AF. I swear, this is about pizza. In episode 6, we deliberately spoke about chasing new experiences. And when we just got married, we wanted to eat it all and do it all. And most of our adventures were happening on the weekends. So we were looking for something quick and easy that we could do during the week. And what's quicker and easier than pizza? Yeah, but the weight also comes quick and easy with the pizza. And this was during a time when I was trying to lose weight. So as when I came to a compromise and we decided that we were gonna aim for one pizza adventure a week, but that every week we'd go to a new place. We'd find and discover a new place altogether. But most importantly, before we took a bite of that pizza, we'd have to pay for it up front, not with money, but with sweat. Since then, we've had many bites, and we've had many great adventures along the way. But we worked our pizzas. Like, we climbed those steps, those hundred steps up Mount Pariah. We jumped around Skinner Park. We walked Palmy's Park. We did some hiking trails and some water sports. Don't get me started. I'm walking around the savannah. We went one day to walk around the savannah. And he says, you know, in case you're fed up on walking around here, you want a little adventure, a surprise. Oh, yeah, you just get married, you're happy. Yeah, I'll take you surprise. Walking around the savannah, a little boring. Oh my god. It was Lady Chancellor. Oh. His way to get me around there was. One more corner. All right, we do the corner. One more corner. After 40 corners and a whole lot of chair, I have to say, the people who walk and run there, they're really nice. Everybody was like, you could do it, you could do it. At one point, he was literally dragging me up here. I'm hooked on his shoulder. And he pulled me a little bit again. But I'll tell you this much. The view was absolutely gorgeous. And where they lies. <sighs> but the pizza was even better. <laughs> she didn't lie! <laughs> and that is why we're telling you this story whilst exercising today. Because Asma and I are due for another pizza adventure. But first, I think I should tell you where we have been so far. And the list is actually quite extensive. We've been to Mario's, most locations, to Pizza Boy's, to all locations of Pizza Hut, to Domino's, to Papa John's. We've been to all locations of La Cantina, Port of Spain, Tobago, and in South, which is now closed. We've been to Shimalicious down in Point Fortin, to Cava, Cape Rock, to Buzo, to Baku, to La Tartaruga in Tobago, to Ara House, Argentinian Pizza, to Via, uh, to Joe's in Maraval and Chibonas, Subway recently when they launched their pizza, Abu's Subs and Pizza when he was in Monroe Road, um, Price Mark Pizza of course, Darus Salam in Grand Bazaar, Amazing Arabian which opened recently in Marabella, my mother-in-law's kitchen, that counts, I have, it has to come for me. <laughs> uh, we fit to Rizzoli's as well, uh, to Twin Subs when they were at Baraka Grounds, uh, to Little Caesars and to Chow Pizzeria, which used to be in Tobago, but is now closed. And that rounds off our list at 24. Whoa, that's a lot of pizza. And we're not done yet, because our to-do list still includes Dove's Dit Oven, the original pizza pal in Mantle, Cafe Delma, Quick Slice, Portico and Pizza Squares, Chop Chops, um, there is Pepe's Pizza, and today we're going to Nafa's Pizza. Well, after we take a bath, of course. Maybe a nap too.
chances are this is going to be very loud in the background so I'm hoping that you can hear me but welcome not just to you but to Asma and myself as well to Nafa Pizza here in Chase Village we're literally on the Chase Village flyover just off of the highway you cannot miss it it's right at Warehouse 2000 complex in front of the hardware so you, it's literally the first restaurant you'll see when you get here anyways we're excited to be here because one it's our first time being here two we earned it as you saw we sweat and paid in, in, in sweat to earn this pizza experience and thirdly because it's a place where everything is halal and that makes it so much easier for both Asma and myself because all of those places we would have been to before we would have had to do our due diligence in advance to find out what meats if any are halal if their cheese is rented free as in vegetarian cheese and if there's any sort of um, you know um, cross contamination of items during the, the process of making the pizzas and the food etc so we would have had to do all of that due diligence beforehand before we would have visited all of those pizza places um, that we mentioned that I would have mentioned to you before so Nafa is actually pretty easy peasy it's quite comfortable because we can literally close our eyes and pick anything and we'll be safe because all meats are halal what it's gonna taste like I don't know but stay with us on this vlog on this marriage vlog and you too will find out So although indoor dining is now allowed, the best part of this pizza adventure for us is not the exercise, it's not even the pizza, it's being able to share the experience together and to share it with our friends and family. Good pizza. This, however, has brought us to the end of our eighth, mm -hmm. our eighth episode of Happily Entangled AF. Hope you enjoyed the pizza adventure, but most importantly, we hope that our adventure will inspire you to begin your own adventures. Not necessarily another pizza adventure, but whatever you and your significant other are into. If that's a roti hop, if that's a double stop doesn't matter it doesn't even have to be food it could be touring beaches across the country visiting Libraries. whatever anything that floats your boat and tickles your fancy start your own marriage adventure today start your own legacy and who knows it could become a tradition that's passed on to your family and the generations after you that you have the opportunity to start right now so thanks for viewing hope you like like share, share and subscribe, subscribe. We like it well plenty right now, but not on social media, <laughs> just the pizza. But um, till next week, thanks again. And, and bon appetit. <laughs>